Welcome to Crash Racer. Today we are playing Wreckfest and we are going to have a go at the latest weekly challenge which is this one here. This one is a winter derby. So let's get into this. It's at the Fairfield Mud Pit, of course still snow covered. Still a couple weeks left of the uh, the winter season. I'm going to use our automatic gears half off half and I'm going to use tuning settings of 4343. So we need 10,000 points or more for the gold trophy in this one. We're in the road cutter, we've got three minutes to get those points. We are going to be racing down into the center and I'm going to be using my normal tactics for this one, which is instead of just keep it running, I'm just going to try and get one or two hits if I can. If I think I've got another hit, I'll keep going, but if I'm not sure where my next hit is coming from, then I'll just quickly reset and back down into the middle. Of course, you get then a really good view of where you can get another hit from. That does seem to be the best way of uh, getting a good score. Certainly you should be able to uh, get a gold trophy score, no problem at all. Of course, like that, if we can see any that are badly damaged and we know we can wreck them, definitely try and take those out. And of course the idea is to attempt to not let that score multiply and next to my score drop at all if possible. Easier said than done, but uh, as long as you can chain the hits together, not leave any big gaps in between the hits, then you should be able to uh, keep it going. And of course, in that way, the, the speed that your uh, score increases really uh, does increase as you get towards the end of the challenge. Your score starts shooting up at that point. Big hit there. <laughs> right, that one straight into the middle. Up to four times score multiplier now and lots of badly damaged vehicles here. It's quite nice when they're clustered in the middle like this because they sort of uh, get stuck a little bit and you can just aim down into the middle and hit them. Of course the only problem is if there's a, a badly damaged one they, they sort of uh, get in each other's way and you can't get through. Oh, it's a nice easy... Oh, I thought it was going to wreck it. Not quite. It's still there but I probably can't get through to it on this run. Just over a minute left then. And we are, there we go, there's the silver trophy and probably just one or two more hits and we'll be at the gold. Here's an easy wreck hopefully. Yeah, that's what we needed <laughs> to get us over the 10,000 points for the gold trophy. Still a minute left, so can we keep this going? I don't think we've had the uh, score multiplier drop in at all. Let's see if we can keep it like that. We'll take another easy hit on the limo on its roof. Of course I'm going to uh, be releasing my latest online racing video again towards the end of the week. Uh, that will probably be on Friday as normal. And that one's called Tactical Takeout so look out for that one. I think uh, I think you might enjoy that one. Again there's going to be three more online races, C-class races. Can I get this one? Ah, oh, Playing cat and mouse and the multiplier is dropping. I need to hit something quickly. Managed to save it actually without it dropping too much and of course we've only got over just over 10 seconds left anyway so no big issue. I was hoping I might get over 30,000 points but not quite there. Reasonable score though of 27,116. So good enough for the gold trophy on this weekly challenge. Best of luck for all your attempts on this one. Let me know how you get on and uh, what scores you managed to get and if any of you managed to get over that 30,000 mark. Best of luck. I hope you've enjoyed watching this video and if you have, please like and subscribe and see you soon.